Hey guys, here is our first video. I'm going to be posting up a lot of these in order to uh, help us out with class, both on uh, our laboratory assignments and also lectures. So uh, keep keep looking at the videos and they should be able to help you out in this class a lot. So this first one that I wanted to walk through is a little bit of how to do our uh, software installation to get all of the tools that we need for class. Uh, the Windows install is a little easier, it's a little shorter. Uh, the Mac is a little longer. There are two more steps that you have to take in order for things to work out. Um, but uh, the basic principles are the same. We need to download R, we need to download R Studio. And if we have a Mac, we also need to download Xcode and Xquartz. Uh, most of these I've put links on. Uh, the only one that I haven't is this Xcode from the App Store. Uh, and then there is a specific package within our studio that we need to load and then we also need to download Excel uh, if we if you don't already have it uh, so let's go ahead and click on this first one we need to let's take a look at this R download so I'm going to go ahead and click on this <clears throat> and it pulls up this page from CRAN it's a uh, to the guys who make R available and we want to get the most recent release so it's this R 3.5.1 package I'm going to go ahead and click on that download it and it's going to say you know okay where do you want it and we can uh, we can just put it in the downloads we'll click save and you see down there that it says that it's open and I'm going to go ahead and click on it and then you have this installation. Uh, so I already have this already installed on my computer, so I'm not going to install it again, but this is just your basic installer. Click continue and let the installer go ahead and install that. So that's how we get R. Uh, let's go ahead and go back. The next one that we need is R Studio. We're gonna go ahead and click on this link. And it says so installers for support platform so we can put this on Windows Mac I guess you've got uh, Linux or something that you could drop those on as well um, but once again you just click the one that you need so here I'm going to click on just the Mac OS 10 and it's going to ask where I want to put it again and that's fine I'll just put it into the downloads again click Save it installed I'm going to click on this and as it's downloading it's going to open up and then it's going to ask me to drag the R studio into the application and then continue on uh, your merry way and you should be able to get it all done now when you have installed this so whether you're on a Mac or if you're on a Windows machine you're going to have to go look at your applications or your programs and you can scroll down and you should be able to see R and R Studio. At this point, both the, the uh, Windows guys, you will be all done. You won't have to do any more steps. Um, but Mac will have to do a couple more. But let's go ahead and open up R Studio. Let's see if it's working okay. We'll go ahead and click on it, and you should get some sort of terminal that looks like this. And if we get to this point, we know that we've done it okay. I'm going to minimize this. Mac guys, we need a couple more things. We also, I'm going to open up the App Store. When you go to the App Store, we're going to type in up here Xcode, Xcode, and go ahead and hit enter. And there's this developer tools that we need. Uh, don't worry, you don't have to know how to do any coding, but uh, there, there's a program that needs some of the tools in there. So you go ahead and click Git. I've already downloaded it. Um, but this is the one that you want, the one with the hammer and kind of the blueprint in the background. Okay, we've got one more piece that we need for the Mac guys, and it's this download exports. Click here, and it's we've got clicking onto this download. Download the exports. I'll just put in my downloads. Click save. And I can click on this guy. Give it a second to download. Okay. 
and there you've got your package and you can go ahead and open it so I want to close out of there I'm going to eject this one because I already have it and that should be it so we will have downloaded our our studio and then if you have a Mac continue to do Xcode and exports um, for the Xcode and the exports you may have to open them up and give them some permissions uh, for the first time through but then after that you don't have to touch it now everybody will go back to our studio and I want to try to make this a little bit bigger but we're going to go click on this right side there's a tab that should say packages we want to click on this and these are all the sorts of libraries that you can load that give you extra functions within R and there's a specific one that we need we want to click on install and we're going to type in RCMDR. That's what we're going to need, this very first R commander. And then you also want to make sure that this little check mark is clicked for install dependencies um, because it needs a couple other packages as well. And when you click on this, uh, it'll download everything that it needs. Uh, so I've already got that installed, so I'm going to just click cancel and when it works you're going to scroll down in your packages all the way down to our commander and then I'm just going to click this little checkbox and it's going to say that it's loading it's pulling all the required packages already and it should open up this secondary window and this is going to be kind of our bread and butter for this whole semester we're going to be using a lot of this R Commander and the tools that are in there. So that should get you started to be able to get R Commander up and running on both a Mac or a Windows machine. The last thing I wanted to show was getting Excel on your computer if you didn't have it yet. So what you can do is click on the link, this office.com, and you can put in your school email address click the get started and you can get it for free so anyways that should get you started <laughs>